What up YouTube, Jade up here, and I got another video for you guys. So today, I am changing out, uh, we're working on the Challenger, 2023 Challenger Dark Horse. Uh, it goes for, uh, it's going to paint tomorrow. So it should be getting prepped. I got everything in the car, taking it over to my dude who's painting it. Super excited for that, so we'll get more into that later. But uh, right now, I got a new part for the bike. Uh, I hate the brake, uh, the rear brake pedal on this bike. It's just a peg. As you can see, it's just a peg. I mean, it works, but I just, I prefer a fatter pedal. And on the Pursuits, you get this. Oh, so that is going to be much, much nicer. Uh, like I said, I got the kit for this. Uh, if you buy this directly uh, off the parts list for the Pursuit, it's like $300 plus for everything. Pads separate, bolts separate, everything. So, I am basically just, uh, I ordered the kit. And I'll leave a link to the part number. And it comes pre-assembled and everything, ready to go. And this is like 186 bucks, So, much, much, much cheaper. And I'm, yes, I'm very excited to try this. So, we're going to install this. I don't think it's going to be too difficult. So, let's, uh, let's get into it. Looks like the first thing we're going to have to do is remove that spring. Now, in the kit, I got a whole bunch of new parts. And I may not be able to do this all today. I don't know yet. Yeah. See, there's a snap ring in there. I don't know if I have snap ring pliers or not. But it does have a new, it does have new uh, parts that came with this kit. So, we'll replace it with everything we see on here. We'll just have to keep an eye on how that all comes apart so we don't lose nothing. Ugh. All right, got the, got that off of there. Okay, so there's the first part. Okay, next, I do believe we've got to take that collar off back there. Okay, so you have to see this collar off right here. It snaps in place right here. I just used a pair of needle noses and pushed it up, and that should push the pin out right like that got it all right that was easy enough so now this is loose from here so that could fall back next i think we're going to take these bolts out here okay these are i believe eight millimeter and we got to make sure when we, we swing this away that we don't tip this reservoir upside down because we don't want an air bubble to get into the brake system so let's see if we can get that off okay guys so basically once you take this off here i told you you gotta un uh unscrew those those are eight millimeter uh allen head bolts i just got them off down there okay once you do that you gotta make sure you keep the pedal upright you don't want to get air down into your reservoir then you're going to have a, a problem with your brakes feeling soft, you're gonna have to bleed them. So I put a box under here, it seems to be working okay. Now, you gotta kinda swing the, the floorboard away so you can kinda look at the back here. And as you can see, we have a snap ring. So I had to literally go buy a set of snap ring pliers, okay? So let's see. If I can, if I can actually, I don't know if you guys can actually see what's going on. All right, now that I got the old one off, let's, uh, it's really nice because there's a sleeve in there and the sleeve on here is already pre-pressed. I just put some general purpose grease inside there so it stays lubed up. I would say just, I wouldn't go crazy, but just enough to where it can pivot pretty good. So, done that. All right. Then theoretically, this should just slide on here. Okay, I went ahead and put the new spring on the uh, brake pedal. I feel like it's gonna be easier to get it hooked. It'll be easier to get it around that 
than here, in my opinion. Uh, we'll find out. Uh, this I have. The uh, I have it in. Okay, I'm putting the other washer in. Make sure you put the first washer in before you slide the the the, the pedal arm on, and then you put this washer on here, and then you got to put the snap ring back on. Okay. Just gonna leave the old one off. Put the new one on. Oh, how much of a pain is this gonna be? If you can see anything or not. Oh crap, it came off. Okay. That's on there. Good. Okay. I'm going to say... Go ahead and... Oh, man. I don't know if, which way that, that's going to go on easier. It's going to suck either way. God, I hate springs. Okay, I got the spring on. So I think we're good there. Now I'm gonna have to put that pin back in. So in order to do that, we might have to turn this down a little bit. Bring that down. So we'll see. Got the pin in, so that's that. So theoretically, all we gotta do now. Ooh, that is a little bit. It's a little tight. So. We might have to play that down a little bit. All right, so I got the uh, I got the uh, floorboard bolted back in, and I'm not gonna lie, that looks awesome. The only thing is, this I'm gonna have to wait till I get the bike done. I might have to adjust this because that seems awfully short. So I'm sure you can adjust it here, but yeah. We're going to have to see what happens with that. But overall, I'm happy. It looks good. Nice and sturdy. I love it. All right, y'all. And I think that's going to do it. Uh, I wasn't too bad. Uh, I needed to get snap pliers. That was the one thing I wasn't expecting. Uh, outside of that, it really wasn't too terrible. Uh, might need a little bit of adjustment on those screws off to look into that a little bit. I won't know anything until I get this bike back from paint and get everything put back together. And if I got to adjust it, I got to adjust it. But I think it's going to be a million times better than the peg. I hated the peg. So I'm really excited to have a pedal now. So, um, like I said, guys, I'm going to continue to shoot more videos. Uh, I'm going to try to show a little bit of this thing getting painted and everything else. Like I said, I got the whole back of my car is just filled with motorcycle parts. So, yeah. Super excited for that. 
Please, if you haven't already, consider subscribing. Like, share, and comment. I try to get back to everybody I can in the comments. It really helps me out, and I really appreciate talking to you guys. Uh, everybody's been really uh, supportive and everything, and I appreciate it. Just keep it coming, guys. So until next video.